All right, welcome back to Daytime Tri-Cities. Once again, we are live this morning here in our bureau in downtown Greenville, getting you ready for all kinds of fall fun events that they have going on. A big celebration as well. We are talking about a 40th anniversary celebration for Main Street Greenville. And we have good friend Jan Murkoff here with us to kick things off this morning. We're in morning. beautiful neon pink, getting ready for all kinds of fun things. Congratulations on your anniversary. Thank you, 40 years. 40 years. 40 years working in this community. Greenville is the first Main Street community in the state of Tennessee. Oh my goodness. Yeah, and they've done incredible work over those 40 years to really we have. bring people downtown and start that movement. We have. I don't think people realize a, a lot that we at one point in time owned the hotel, the General Morgan Inn, the Brumley. Um, that we held on to till we could find a developer. We at one time owned the Capitol Theater and made that available to the Little Theater. Um, we've been involved in parking and keeping the high school downtown and USS Greenville, you name it. So it's, you know, we've had a, we've had a good run and we're still moving. Absolutely. Yeah. And you can see that downtown, the progress and businesses opening, yeah. businesses thriving, new things happening. And this week you are celebrating. We're talking big aquanet hair, <laughs> neon pink parachute <laughs> pants. You're going back to the 80s. We are going back to the 80s. We're doing this Thursday night at the General Morgan Inn. We're doing a totally awesome 80s party. And it's going to be, it's going to be a lot of fun. We encourage people to uh, dress the part. But they don't have to. We just want them to come and enjoy things. Um, great buffet dinner done by the chef at the hotel. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, that will be wonderful uh, drinks. Um, we, our sponsors have been great. Greenville Federal Bank, uh, Century 21, uh, Southbound Real Estate, um, to name a few that are um, being part of that. But the best part is we still have a few tickets left. Yay, because it's only two days away. It it's is. Up. It is only two days away. You don't have to go on Eventbrite. You don't have to do anything really special other than call the office. Okay. And that's 423-639-7102. Uh, and I'll fix you up with some tickets. So not a problem. It's from 7 to 11. But Amy, the fun part is Robbie Britton is going to be spinning vinyl only. Oh, how fun. You know, it sounds different. It, it does. does. It does. Right? And so it will be actual albums right there, song selection, the whole nine yards. So you'll be dancing. And for those of you that grew up in the 80s and had a lot of fun, uh, the committee is, is having a blast. There's some sure. candy treat bags from back then. It's just going to be a good, it's going to be a good fun night. So if you want some tickets, give the office a call and I'll fix you up with them. Nothing like the 80s, man. I'm no. Gonna well, be other than, can't wait to see everybody. other than a few generations or a few decades <laughs> before that, we're pretty special too. But yes, yeah. yes, but the 80s has the great music. It does. And oh, it's just going to be, everybody's going to be dancing. It's it does. Be It'll be fun. And then you're also getting ready. Fall is such a beautiful season. And I know downtown Greenville has so much fun with these scarecrows. And you're bringing that back again. We are, 14 years. Wow. When we started that uh, back in the day, they say, uh, we were the only people that did anything like that in Northeast Tennessee. And thanks to folks like yourself that helped to publicize that, we actually have people that, that do come in from outside the area just to see the scarecrows. They're set up within the Main Street District. This year we have, oh, a couple dozen plus, and the public votes, they can do that based on a QR code. The displays are up by seven o'clock on October the 9th, which is a week from yesterday. They'll be judging and they'll remain up all month. And it's so much fun because then too you get to vote, you get to be part of it, and people go all out as we showed some of the pictures. Yes. So you're able to see, I mean this is something that I think the businesses and the different organizations have so much fun putting them together and then the public has so much fun supporting. Oh, uh, it's so much fun. I'm lucky at my office because there are several displays because anybody from outside the immediate area can also do a scarecrow. And so we'll find them a spot to display it. I have the best seat in the house because people walk through with their children. 
take pictures of their children in the displays, their pets in the displays. So it's great, doesn't cost a thing to enter. And Broyles General Store is our sponsor. And so the winners get gift cards so you can shop at Broyles, which is one of Greenville's hidden treasures. You've got a lot of good places to shop, we do. eat, and all that good we do. stuff. All right, well, Jan, congratulations. 40th anniversary. Thank that you. That is exciting for Main Street Greenville. Don't forget, as she said, there are a few tickets left for that totally awesome 80s party coming up Thursday night at the General Morgan Inn. You can get more information on that by going to the Main Street Greenville on Facebook or giving their office a call as well. And then look for those scarecrows coming up in October. We'll be back with more of Daytime right after this.